guys like those expensive sunglasses? The ones that cost hundreds of dollars, you find them at places like the Sunglass Hut or wherever it is. Yeah, I thought I might try that too. I'm not a very materialistic person, but uh, every once in a while, I'll invest the money into something if I think I'm going to get the value out of it. And unfortunately, sunglasses are just one of those areas you will not get your money's worth out of it. Other than the style, it's just functionally a worse product. <laughs> That's all there is to it, guys. I got to refrain from what I really want to say because I honestly think sunglasses are one place where people constantly get robbed. And if you're a road warrior and you are always out on the road, I highly suggest you wear eyewear because I used to drive a truck and I used to be out in the sun all the time. And it does wear on your vision. So wear some protection when you're out on the road. And if you do so, don't invest into the most expensive product on the market because it's not worth it. Let's take a look at what I mean. So here we have a few pairs of sunglasses. I have gone through a couple of them because I thought maybe it's just one brand that's defective. Maybe it's the other. At first, I tried Under Armour. These ones here were really nice. I used to wear them on the jet ski until <laughs> the lenses started flaking off. What the hell is this? And look at the rubber. The rubber is just degrading just naturally. How crazy. You see that? So I thought, okay, maybe it's the brand. So I switched and these ones are Oakley's. I thought, all right, let's give a set of metal frame Oakley's. I was getting away from the plastic. I was like, all right, you can see, like even here, look at that. It's just completely degrading, just pulling away. That's only from a couple of years. And that, the lens is flaking, that happened within the first year. Now I consider sunglasses either disposable or they're gonna be the type of product I'm gonna use for years. It's gonna sit in my car and I'm gonna use it for years and years uh, because it's a very low wear and tear type of device right it just kind of sits on your face when you're done you put them back on you know their case in in the in the car well these ones here i thought all right let's try a nice metal frame set of oakley's you see that very very soon i had those things fall off the nose pieces and i was like all right that's not a problem i can deal with that and i did for a while but then you have to deal with these guys right here See that little fastener in the corner? See that one's tight. I tighten this one all the time. I've even tried Loctite on it. It pops out and when it pops out, it wears on this lip that's in the bottom of your um, lenses. Complete trash. Oakley's trash, Under Armour trash. Now I'm not saying all sunglasses are trash. What I'm saying is that you're not getting the value. You got $150, $200 sunglasses, $200 some dollar sunglasses. You do not get the money's worth out of it. So what was the alternative? Guys, I'm telling you, this is the alternative and what a fantastic product this is. I will probably even leave a link in the description down below this video because I have worn this exact pair. These are two different versions. I've worn this pair for a long, long time. And then I moved to this pair because I lost that one. Somebody stole it, actually. It hit the ground. I turned around and they were gone. Somebody picked them up and ran off with them. Guys, these are only $25 to $30 sunglasses. Now these ones here are 30 some dollar sunglasses. I think they're like $39. And for the money, for that $40 pair of sunglasses, you get a pair of sunglasses that have a gasket around the outside that have breather holes and it allows it to stand off from the face. And this is for particulates. When you're in a work environment, you have the gasket. And this is such a wonderful pair of glasses. And for the extra money, you also get a case. So if you want to store them in your toolkit, you just put them in the bag, just like this bag right here that came with the 200 and some dollar Under Armors. This one is brand new. I just opened it up. These are $40 and the gasket is removable. And for a long time, Home Depot did not have these in stock. 
and they just started having these in stock. I nabbed them as soon as I could. I mean, think about it. $30 for a pair of sunglasses, $40 for the pair with the gasket and the bag. That is an absolute steal, and they're basically almost disposable. But here's something else that you might not consider. Let's take any one of these. You see that? Yes, the lens is a little dirty, but notice that there's also scuffs and scratches on there. Yeah, of course that one's boogered up, but just the same. There's scuff and scratches on there because the lens is prominent. Look, when you when you lay it down, or if they fall off your face or whatever, the lens is definitely going to impact the ground. Well, with these other ones, notice how the lens it does bow out a little bit in the middle, but there is actually a bezel around the outside that will protect the lens. And I have had this pair fall off my face several times. You know, you're working on something, the wind comes up, I've even riding a motorcycle, they'll, they'll fly off, you know, and go scooting across the ground, just go and pick them back up. And the best part is, I can go to any Home Depot now that they're in stock, and I can pick up another pair for $29. And I am so happy, guys. So when I'm driving my car, these are absolute fantastic because there's a certain hue that some glasses will put on. And this one here, it actually helps my vision. If it's raining out just a little bit, I've noticed that these ones here allow me to see through the rain a little bit, a little bit better than with your naked eye, that's for sure. And guys, I am in no way going to make money off suggesting these products. I buy these with my own money. I just want you guys to know when there is a better alternative out there to help you do your life and <laughs> your business a little bit better. And for me, that means getting the best bang for your buck for a product. And when it comes to designer eyeglasses or this expensive garbage, it just doesn't cut it. $30, $40 for a pair of glasses. They've fallen off my face. I beat the hell out of, out of these glasses before. And they just don't scratch like the other ones. I can clean them so much easier. And I've never had the rubber break down because look at they do to have some butylene overmolded uh, earpieces right here, but other than that, I have never had those wear out. I've been around petrol. You know, usually uh, oil type products can degrade things like rubbers. I've never had that problem with any of these glasses, and they're very, very durable. They're designed for an industrial work environment, and that's the kind of product I can stand behind. So guys, $20, $30, $40 dollar glasses, that's what I'm talking about. That is going to save you a lot of effort, a lot of grief, that's for sure. And uh, Milwaukee seems to have done it right. So check out your local Home Depot, or I'll leave a link to both these products because there's one with the gasket and one without in the description down below. All right. Thanks for watching, guys.